and everything. And then he's like kind of wrecking them. And then I see later on, like this, like one like um, like um, Majin Buu kind of like thin Buu looking like um, creature called like Lagus. Ends up actually shooting like this huge like shards of like crystal at Goku. And then Goku's actually struggling like the hold it off in his Ultra Instinct Omen form and everything, which uh, I thought that he might have like mastered while he actually trained with the Grand Priest in order to master Ultra Instinct and everything. And if that's the case, then like why isn't he actually like tearing up people a lot more than what he is? You know, like this fight actually should almost be over with. But no, like, uh, for some reason, Goku actually, instead of actually dodging the strike, he ends up actually trying, uh, landing his hands on the crystal and trying to overpower it. And then later on, ends up shattering the crystal. But then, he actually ends up actually losing his Ultra Instinct form because he, like, struggled with the crystal. And then, like, um, he's like, oh, like, who are you? And then like the woman is saying like like I'm Lagus, and then they see like she shoots like, actually all these those shards of glass like crystal like things at Goku, and it seems like it's actually cutting up Goku all over, and for no reason like Goku's like ah screaming in pain and everything, but then like when like um uh, you actually can see him again. He, does, he looks like he has a few scratches on him, but where's the blood? Where's the blood? I don't understand that. I mean, like, um, he should be cut up, like, more, way more than what he was. And then, like, um, as soon as she's like, I'm Lagos, and then, like, ends up actually, like, um, shooting, um, fr the shards from down, uh, from on the ground upward at Goku, and starts scraping him up, like, slicing him up like crazy. See, I'm thinking, are you kidding me, Goku? How is it that you actually getting defeated so easily by these guys when you're like, supposed to be in ma more mastered form of Ultra Instinct? That, that doesn't make any sense. That's what I'm saying. This is stupid. I mean, Goku gets defeated this easily, this soon, the moment he ended up actually coming into, like, a... Um, um, onto the battlefield. Really, Goku? I, I just don't get this. I mean, like, how did you actually get tore up this badly by a little crystallized thing like this? I mean, like, oh, like, I mean, I thought that Goku should be, like, a lot more powerful than he is right now. You know, you should be able to maneuver, dodge, evade, and everything, but yet he's getting tore up. I'm thinking, come on, dude. Really? And if I, if I was like the Grand Priest, I, I would actually be ashamed. You know, he just like got into the battlefield, and the next episode he's taken out. Like he actually wasn't even there. You know, like, that, that was garbage. Goku, about actually how you were able to only actually land like a few shots in on baby's children and then like when they fuse you battle for a little bit and then like that actually happens. I mean come on man. I thought you actually you, you were looking all big and bad all like like oh yeah I got this guys. I got like this like angry looking on my face and he's like, like yeah I'm serious. I'm serious. I'm about to like, kick some butt here and everything and then get stomped gets wrecked like he's like nothing. I mean you gotta show like that uh, Goku isn't actually all that. He's nothing. I mean I get <laughs> I don't understand actually why everybody thinks like oh Ultra Instinct is like so incredible so amazing but yet he ends up getting stomped. Who cares about Ultra Instinct? You know I mean I, <laughs> or so, I mean like he sh uh, if he was actually like, serious about actually taking these guys out, he probably he, he should have tried, but no, he was just trying to play around, like maneuvering, dodging, 
sliding out of the way. And then until he actually wasn't able to dodge out of the way and then gets stomped, even though, like, those shards of, of, of like, strikes that were on him didn't even show no blood. He should have been more, way more cut up than what he was. And I'm thinking, like, come on. Like, um, after all that, he actually didn't even receive, like, tremendous amount of damage. But yet, I know that if it was another person actually suffering that damage, then, oh, yeah, they would actually be taken out, like, crazy. And most likely have already been killed. But no, since it's Goku, Ultra Instinct and everything, he's able to survive this and everything. And now, actually, we're going to have Vegeta... Actually, I like, um go to his like Super Saiyan bluer form, and actually gonna fight and everything. Because why? Because Ultra Instinct Goku that just came last episode is taken out already. That's just like, stupid.